So I know that there are definitely some people out there who want to play Need for Speed The Run, but are on an Xbox Live account and you try to, but it doesn't work. So here's a step-to-step -step tutorial on how you can do this. So firstly, put the disc in. I'm going to basically show you the normal problem on why it doesn't work normally if you're on an Xbox Live account. So the startup is all normal um, on the first bit. So they, you will always see this, whether you're connected to any account. And then if I press start there on my controller, it will then just load for a minute. And basically, it'll take you onto an infinite loading screen. It will do nothing but load. So if you just select this, as you can see here, Need for Speed The Run is loading the save data, obviously, because I've tried this before. Um, but basically what will happen, because you are on an Xbox Live account, it will just try to connect to the autolog servers infinitely. So in a nutshell, you won't be able to play the game. But here is a little tutorial on how to do it. So if you go back to your Xbox home, and then head over to the profiles and down to sign in or out, Press A and sign out with your current account. Um, and now you are not signed into any account. Now, play Need for Speed the Run. I will skip the entire startup. Okay, so now we're not on any account. Um, we are just on Need for Speed the Run. And now it wants us to press start. Okay. So, that'll do that. And now instead, it will say sign in. Now, if you see here, this profile had the Xbox Live account. This one on top doesn't, but we'll get to that in a minute. Um, but the Xbox Live, you want to make sure you sign into an account which doesn't have this here, or you create a new profile and don't connect to Xbox Live. And then if you, as you can see, the top one doesn't have an Xbox Live signed in. So, basically, what happens is the... Uh, EA servers instantly try to go on to the online kind of servers, but uh, this game has been shut down, so there is no thing here. Now, when you should come on, it should say offline for that, uh, and then you just press the hard drive. It basically say this. Okay. Uh, and then it will say up the top, fail to connect to autolog server. If you're on an Xbox Live account, this will not happen. And then it says here, you must be signed into Xbox Live and the EA servers in order to access the online features of this game. Now, the good thing is, if we just press OK, we get into the main menu of Need for Speed The Run. Unfortunately, if your account is already on Xbox Live and you want to grab some achievements for this game, unfortunately you can't. But if you just want to have a quick fix and just want to play this game, it is a simple, easy and free way to play the game. Which otherwise people might have struggled with. So I hope you guys found this tutorial... Well, I hope it helped. Because uh, I know I'm probably going to play some of this game as I was stuck for a while, but I managed to get it. So, yeah. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.